people praying for that is fini. Now now they play why I say I'm happy. I want to tell my own people ne. I say you are pray with it. We coming to fini now. I also think coming to fini. So I want to tell the tour of the ongoing project at the Timber River Bridge by the government was greeted with appreciation by passengers and residents in the area. Giving a brief history about government's intervention of the Timber River Bridge project was Public Works Minister Mabutu Nyipan. You will recall that in 2017, the government of Liberia signed a contract with Jupiter Construction Company for the replacement of three important bridges that have aged significantly along the route between Grand Bassa and the Southeast. Today we are very pleased that we have come and we have seen progress, significant progress that has been made on the first of the three billet bridges uh, that are targeted for replacement. Where we are right now is the Timber River Bridge. This river is the boundary between Grand Bassa County and Riverside County. And over the years, the billet bridge that was here has been experiencing a lot of problems, structural problems, etc., etc. And so the government made a determination that we would change this billet bridge. And so upon the inception of this new administration, we reactivated the contract which was signed in 2017. And upon the reactivation of the contract, we made some payments. And as a consequence of those payments, today we've come to see a brand new Bailey Bridge over the Timor River Bridge. And we'd like to first say thank God. Thank God for this important development. We'd like to thank His Excellency the President for his commitment the infrastructure development in our country. We want to thank our contractors. They've done so well. Our contractors, the, the team of engineers, the team of technicians, and the team of ordinary workers, 100% Liberians. I think this is good news for our country. And so we've come today. You will recall also that three months ago, the contractors started work on this project in honest, three months ago. In fact, we'll say technically two months, two weeks ago. Today, if you look at the work that has been done, you will agree with me that the completion of this bridge is between 95 to 97%. Mm -hmm. What is left is something that can be done in five days. In five days, all of the works around here will be completed. But again, as engineers, as technicians, when the work is completed, you have to give time for what we call demobilization, so that the area will be clear. And so we can say to you today, and we want you to say to the Liberian people, that yes, we indicated at a point in time that by the 15th, this bridge will be completed. Today is the 16th. We've come on the 16th, and you see 95 to 97 percent completion. And the reason why we have the little three percentage problem is because of the heavy damp of rains which occurred over the past uh, two weeks. And you know this is nature, there is little or nothing that we can do about it. But in the midst of it, especially during the rainy season, the contractors have been able to work to reach this level of progress. The Ministry of Public Works is impressed. We are very happy. And we can say that this bridge will be opened to vehicular traffic on the 24th of July, 2019. So 2019, all of the kingdom business that you see down the waterside will be over. The bridge will be opened. The people who travel along this route will have a brand new billet bridge. Their safety will be assured. Their security will be assured. And goods and services will be will move across this bridge freely without hindrance. Minister Nipan said he was satisfied with the progress of the project. You know what we had here before was almost like a death trap. Yeah. A death trap. So we had to take the hard decision. We, we, we recall that the old bridge that was here was totally removed on the, uh, on the, on the, on the 4th of, 
of, of May. By May 4th, the old bridge was completely removed. And we are now saying to you that by July the 24th, you have a brand new Bailey Bridge. So under two months, or within two months, our engineers, our technicians, the contractor, even the manufacturer of the bridge had to come all the way from the States to come here and work with our people. That tells you that we want to be assured of value for money. We want to be assured of the best standards. And so today we can proudly say that the problems of the Timber River Bridge are problems of the past. We now have a brand new Bailey Bridge which will be opened to vehicular traffic on the 24th of July. On that day, again, we'll converge here, all of us, because this is a significant infrastructure development. And then we'll cut the ribbon and the bridge will be open to vehicular traffic. Again, like I said earlier, I want to say thank you to the president. These are difficult times for our country, economically speaking. But irrespective of that, the president will take the hard decision to put resources aside for infrastructure development. Imagine if the president didn't have the political will to say, look, let's make payment for a new Bailey Bridge over Timbo. But today we'll still be grappling with the issue of that death trap that is in the past now. So I want to say thank you, Mr. President. I want to say thank you to the entire government. Because Mr. President has said that under his administration, he will connect the various capital cities of our country. He will connect our communities. He will connect Liberia to Liberians. And what we see here today is a clear manifestation of the commitment of Mr. President. Well, contrary to reports, Representative Matthew Jade of Grand Bassa County said he's happy to see the fast development of the project in a short period. What are you guys, the, the full estate for coming, you know, to actually see the reality <coughs> and also to the engineering crew here for their high level of work here, we are actually impressed. More especially, we have been hearing you know, news of romance, you know, about the joy here has been, you know, on perform and all of those things. And that is why the minister make it, you know, his big business to bring us as legislators, you know, to see the fact and to actually, you know, convey the information to our colleagues at the, uh, at the house that, you know, the ministry is actually doing well, you know, in order to connect two counties. So as you can see here, uh, Ali, we see the very good, you know, improvement. The work is well, you know, done and I mean, we are encouraged. And so I am going, going back and I will inform my colleagues that all that we have been hearing, they are all not true. And actually, work here at the Timo you know, River is actually good. And like what he just said, in fact, this time, this road will be open to the public and our people are asset, you know, to commute in between Basel and Riverside. The Timber River Bridge, according to the contractor of Jupiter Construction Company, Floyd Thomas, will be completed soon. Most definitely. Most definitely. Before that. Before the, more, more, more definitely. Before the July celebration, we're looking forward to having the traffic in the next one. And the next one means that there will be car flying this particular bridge. Is that what you yeah. say? Yeah. Okay. If you look up there, we already got the checking ready to go on. So we'll start putting them on. I should have wanted to start putting them on today. Oh. But yes, we are Currently, residents and passengers are using canoes to cross to and from Timber River due to the ongoing bridge project. But what do they make of the ongoing project? The bridge is a problem for, for we a motorcycle because we will bring passengers and we come to the water side. If those are had a boat, a charge of far from the each part to cross. Then if you have it, you can't remove the way I brought it to my shoe, to my shop, and one fifty, which is seven hundred and fifty dollars. Sometimes someone needs to pay so that we didn't notice about the string us. They string us so sometimes we'll charge it and we have to add a press on while we can go pay to the water side. I see it'll be a farm project. It's a farm project for me, it's only taking it just a matter of time. For me, I would like to extend my thanks and appreciation for the construction of the bridge. 
because uh, one of my friends left, you know, on the bridge by accident. So the old bridge that was there while crossing, mm -hmm. the rain, you know, it fell into the, 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 the broken pieces that were there and it left in the water. Mm -hmm. So, you know, it was very powerful. But for now, that we've seen the crossing of the bridge now, and we are very happy. Because when the bridge finish, will be passing through, without will pay money to you know, those that have boat or kino. So for the construction of the bridge, I don't tell you that very government. Thank you. Very difficult for us because we are facing many, many problems here. Mm -hmm. You see, it? because mm -hmm. even the passengers are all complaining because the transportation now mm -hmm. is, is very hard. But yeah. oh, very happy. I'll be very happy. I'll be very glad for that. Mm -hmm. yeah, if the bridge finish, then that means the suffering will live. Because, because I'm happy. Mm -hmm. If there is no bridge down there, I can be embarrassed. But since they are trying, doing it, doing well. If they are doing well, mm -hmm. I'm very happy. Mm -hmm. I'm very happy for that. Mm -hmm. I'm very, very happy for that because I know they are improving. If it were not soon, because it never started soon. It's been almost three to four months before they started this bridge. Uh -huh. And now, since they started it, you have not made complete two months yet. And I is so. Tell us about the problem. One for the bridge of finish, sir. Mm -hmm. Now we are suffering. <laughs> two times, three times. Three times? Yeah, from I live at here. At here? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. From at here, yeah, I pay. Mm -hmm. From here, I will pay, you know, mm -hmm. when I get low, mm -hmm. they will charge a low before I carry a girl. Mm -hmm. They carry to the car. Mm -hmm. From a girl, you can't eat one. Mm -hmm. If I take more of car, so we suffering. So, so is, it, is, is, it, is it working? Yeah. The plane, the government have to put a bridge here. You see it working? The bridge is going. On good, I have to. The, br the bridge going on good. Mm -hmm. <laughs> when I take one month, I will have to go. We still finish. Then we suffering. Eh. But five minutes, bridge fall. Then we are living here. We suffering. But Nana, we go make it. When I two months, I will finish. We all the hard time finish. Now no suffering again. So we pray for let it finish. Now, now they play with it. I say, I'm happy. I'm going to tell my own people. Ne. I say, yeah, let's pray with it. We're coming to the now. Yeah. I was suffering coming to the So I went to tell we, we, we just pray to God that God more empower the people to do more what we want for them to do. But you know, this problem, we catch a lot of difficulty. You know, in business people, they get, we just stop to be very frank. You see, they plan some, we got a plan almost two months again. Our business are spotting. But you know, we pray to God at least. They stay at the bridge on, we pray to God that it will end you know, as soon as possible. We got hope because we've seen it. At least they stay at the end. We pray to God that God will make it possible for us. Uh, it is true, people are crossing all the you know, using the kingdom to cross all the water because no means to pass all the water, so they have to use the kingdom to pass. Yeah, I'm very excited for the development because our people are suffering. Some people, they are not satisfied, they are taking risks with their life. What do you want to? I can say, I can tell the government of your thank you because of the, the work that they are doing for us. <laughs> and our people have the crops, they want to take the town. But because of the bridge, some of them crops will stay at the area and spot. <laughs> so I want to tell the government thank you for the construction they carry on for the labyrinth. I have the hope that pretty soon we'll be passing on our new bridge. <laughs> yeah. Upon full completion, and based on proper maintenance, it is expected that the bridge, according to experts, will last for 80 to 100 years. This bridge lifespan is 80 years, and with good maintenance, 100 years. The American made steel bridge weighs 800 tons and is capable of taking a massive weight of 85 tons. The bridge, is, the bridge itself weighs about 200 tons and it's capable of taking a maximum of up to 85 ton weight. Generally, in Liberia, even if you take the heavy log trucks, overload it, they'll run you anywhere between 50, maximum 55 tons. But because we don't have way bridges to determine the weight of cars going across, the ministry decided we increase the tolerance to about 85 tons, which, is, which exceeds even military grade. Uh, this bridge was built by uh, Acra Bridge in the U.S. It's the third largest uh, manufacturer of sea bridges in the world. They, they actually supplied quite a bit of bridges to Liberia during the Ecomog. They're all over Africa and they, they're built in spec. So if American standards, uh, uh, it, it's going to last and, and live up to uh, what it's been designed for. Uh, we also made sure that we have a company that stands behind their product. So this bridge is warranty. That's why we do have engineers from the manufacturer here with us to make 
ensuring that we are putting things exactly in the way that they weren't in for the period. The Timber River Bridge links Liberians in the southeast and other parts of the country, as it is expected upon completion to bring great relief to the people of Liberia. Well, the citizens of Basel have impressed. We're not just impressed because we see a bridge. We are impressed because to achieve the president proposed agenda requires the connections of all counties, building bridges where there have been no bridge, and building roads where there have been no roads. And this president, I said that time with all numbers, as he took over over one and a half years ago. But importantly, three months ago, our people have been using means that is not suitable for them. And the president, through the Ministry of Public Work, told him why to do this bridge. If you think I'm here because I want to work about, I'm here because I'm happy. If you could see in my heart, you know that the people of Riverside, even Sando Grand Cru. Most importantly, the, 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 the hospital in Basel is a referral hospital. You got people from Grand Cru and Riverside that go there. They no longer come there because of the bridge situation. We are happy that on the 24th, we have a gift that we never thought of getting. Mm -hmm. And I think uh, we must appreciate this president. And Mr. President, thank you for our bridge. Timbo is being connected. Mr. Minister, thank you. Mr. Chairman on Public Work, you all thank you very much. I don't know how to express the joy and happiness that is in my mind, that is in my heart. But I know that the God Almighty will appreciate this president also. Because we believe that what our people passing through, we went there. People using kinos are not protected. People crossing the river with a goose. In fact, because of this bridge, prices are going high in river says. So we think with the connection of this bridge on the 24th, our people will be able to go back to normal activities. They will move around freely. They will come to hospital freely. Their children will come now to go to the to the community college freely as well. So that thing, Mr. Minister, kudos to you. We will help and work along with you that the maintenance of this bridge. Trust me. I heard somebody asking questions of an illegal manner. As of tomorrow or the after tomorrow, the Ministry of Lands must be informed already. Their team will come back with attack force and make sure that those that Man here, even if they are not illegal, they will not mind our bridge. Because myself, if I come here, I catch them here, with the serious actions, we will be able to stand to protect public facilities. Mm -hmm. We cannot be crying, no development, no development, but development, we cannot maintain development. We must be able to make sure that we work along with citizens to understand what for. Look what, look, look what the drag is. Closer to this bridge. We now see that we are watchful hours to make this thing diminish. Because the 85 years we're going to manage it, it will go up to 100 years. So, Mr. Minister, again, I want to say thank you, thank you. to your team, your engineer, our uh, chairman of public work. We say thank you to all of you, uh, the, the construction company. Yeah, thank you very much. Our people will be able to commute from one place to another. I will be able to leave from Basel to go to Riverside and come by the same day. Yeah. Thank you so much. What we've come to witness today is uh, development in progress. This is one of the many, many projects that we have ongoing in the country. You will know that on the 25th of July, we will be dedicating the uh, ministerial complex. Wow. That's a complex that will be housing six government institutions. On that same day, we'll be dedicating the uh, terminal at the Roberts International Airport. Wow. You will know that the number of road projects have been undertaken, as we speak to you, never before in the history of Liberia have we as a country undertaken so much roles as we are doing now. And I think this is uh, good news for all of us, especially when we talk about uh, road connectivity. So again, we want to thank Mr. President. We want to thank uh, the motivated uh, workers at the Ministry of Public Works, all of our deputy ministers, assistant ministers, our directors, our engineers. We believe that it is because of the team spirit that we are where we are today. And so we'd like to assure Mr. President that we will continue to justify the confidence that he has reposted us as uh, administrators at that ministry, as engineers working together for the good of our country. Thank you so very much.